We all as black people agree on one thing, if nothing else. I don't care what job you have, what religion, what gods you pray to, we all agree on this. We have serious issues. We have issues that other races in this country don't have. And we, we gotta start peeling away at that. This is Russ, Big Russ Barbershop. These are the tools to make it all happen. Master Andy's. Andy's. Master Andy's. iPod, all right? We haven't, in my opinion, we haven't actually been properly taught the power of money. You know, it's, that's a problem in our community. Um, we don't grow up learning about money and the powers of it, you know? We don't, um, it, it's just, and we have trillions of dollars of, of spending power. You know, um, it's really sad, man, once you think about all the money that's being spent and none of it is, is, is productive. And I hear this all the time. Uh, uh, we used to couldn't do this. We grew up without that, you know. Let's face it. Anybody who buys something new, get something new, regardless what color you are, there's a good feeling attached to that, you know? Shopping feels good. Purchasing feels good, no matter what color you are. But our problem is that we equate that to a, we have arrived, or, or status, you know? And it's much easier to spend than to save. There's nothing wrong with not spending money, okay? And letting it sit, you know, and grow. Uh, what we need to do then, we, we need, we need to be able to collectively work with one another. Um, and you see that's how the businesses are ran in our neighborhood. The family business. Uh, family meaning blood or not blood. The human guy told me across the street, he doesn't have to know the human guy on the other corner just because they both are human. He can go there and ask him for a thousand dollars, or go there and ask him for bread, shelter, water, just based on them being the same. He's obligated to help him, and that's the type of thing we're going to adapt. We can't keep separating ourselves from East Harlem, West Harlem, Lincoln Projects, Hampton Projects, uh, West Coast, East Coast. You know, we got to see ourselves as one. You know, and act in according to as we were one. Right. Well, this is work. This is what I do. I am a real person. <laughs> I am a real barber. To the black man of America, I would say, well, let's go back to being refined people like we were. You know, we were great people, kings and queens, you know, and, and we need to get back to that. We need to get back to just accepting who we are, you know, and we haven't been accepting who we are because we haven't, we, we don't know who we are. <laughs>